Hello, my friends, teammates, really, at UFCW. Uh, so glad to, to meet with you today. Uh, today we had a chance to, to discuss what this sisterhood, what this brotherhood is all about. We, we said that we are heirs to access. See, those who have come before us have worked hard. We've been here, and even while we're here, uh, people around us have toiled and, and done great things to move us forward. And we are heirs to all of those gifts. And, and so understanding that, that we are heirs to this, then and let's be responsible uh, with what we've been entrusted with. Let's be consistent. Let's be great team players so that we can move the bar forward. The reality is, is um, some of us are not for all of us. Let me say that again. Some of us are not for all of us. And because of that, we have to remember that we have to continue to fight for diversity. We have to continue to fight through adversity to make sure that we continue to be heirs of this tremendous access. Further to that, we are couriers of freedom. That's how we carry that torch forward, is understanding that it is a fight. We have to be willing to unite to fight for what's right. Right. We are couriers of freedom, a freedom uh, that we've been entrusted with. And, and so with that, we need to move ourselves along so, so that we can contend for one another, uh, ultimately uh, understanding that when we fight for that, there's going to be challenges, there's going to be adversity. There's no question about it. In life, um, adversity is guaranteed. Right? It's not whether or not you have adversity, but how you deal with adversity that will determine your success. Right? In, in fact, um, we, we want to make sure that, that uh, we continue to persist through adversity. Don't feel sorry, don't complain, and don't quit. When you're complaining, you're not competing. Let's be solution-oriented. Keep our eyes on the mark. You don't notice the obstacle until you take your eyes off the goal. And if we do that, right, that'll push us towards being trustees of excellence. Yes, we are trustees of excellence. There's a saying, never ask for more than you're willing to work for, or never hope for more than you're willing to work for. In, in saying that, we want to make sure that on our jobs, right, we are above reproach, that we crave excellence, that we are great at what we do. The H in HD stands for be humble enough to believe that it's going to require your best, your very best, and then exercise the discipline to carry that out. What we're saying is this, as we are trustees of excellence, we need to be humble enough to believe that it's going to require our very best and then exercise the discipline to carry that out. So we are worthy of what we contend for. And if we do that and we are worthy and we are great partners, then the next generation become heirs to that access, the access that we enjoy today.